Good morning, everyone. Uh, this is um, how I start my day. Some fresh fruit today. It's pear and oranges. And a glass of water with lemon in it, lemon juice. Um, my yogurt, lactose-free yogurt. And this one is strawberry. And a cup of tea. And this is the pomegranate one. And of course, it is in my mug from Brenda. You are my sunshine. So this is how I kick off my day. channel. I am off out to get my hair done and uh, yeah it's nice today. Still cold. Zero degrees but um, I'm wearing my leather jacket so Still coughing. What the? I know. Keep smiling. Keep smiling, Francis. Uh, this cough is just pissing me off. Okay. Sometime today, buddy. Where are you going? Come on. Let's move it along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Alrighty. So um, yeah, this, uh, this cough is really um, starting to um, piss me off. <laughs> uh, I guess I should be lucky in a way because it's not keeping me awake at night. And well, the cough's not keeping me awake at night, but all the pillows under me are, Brenda. Thank you, Brenda. <laughs> Brenda told me, you keep your head up, you keep yourself propped up when you have fluid in your lungs. And she's absolutely right. Like, she, you're right, you're right. Yes, mama, yes, mama. Oh, I need a new, uh, I need a little new little stand for my, um, for my phone. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, so uh, I'm used to sleeping on my, um, my contour pillow I like a pillow that has like a little you know like a little contour in it so um, I'm not a fan of um, a lot of pillows underneath me so but that's okay um, I don't want to you know irritate the lungs any more than necessary um, I'm hoping the puffer is working I don't know like you know I'm using it every day and uh, it's a 14 day course so I think I'm getting better. I really do, but it's pissing me off. <laughs> yes, ladies, I do swear. I swear, I do. Um, but you know what? I read somewhere, some somewhere. I think I said this on one of my other videos. I don't know. But I read somewhere that it says people who swear, like swear, like swear like say like really bad words and it's a stress reliever so I'm just you know I'm just swearing because oh no that was a rat no way I thought it was a squirrel but it has no tail it looks like a rat on the on the ew. Ooh. on the road Maybe it's a squirrel with no tail. Because let's face it, like squirrels 
are not that cute when you see them up close. They have beady eyes and they're ugly. I hate squirrels. I do. I'm sorry. I do. Um, chipmunks now are another thing altogether because they're cute and they have like little, little cute little puffed out little cheeks and they're adorable. But squirrels, squirrels are, are, are ugly. I'm just rambling ladies. I don't know. I'm just rambling. Oy vey. But I will feel better when I get my hair cut. It is so dirty. It was due to be washed two days ago, but I wouldn't wash it because I didn't want to have to style it. So I just let it be dirty. So I'm going to go see my little cutie pie Katie uh, and get my eyebrows ripped off. And um, yeah, and I'll be back in a flash. Hey, I'm back guys. Yes. I did get my hair cut. Now it's time for a little bit of lipstick, mm, lip gloss, and mm, pink, pink, pink. It's all about the pink. And I am starving. Absolutely starving, guys. I've got my hand clan bag, handbag, and I got a blunt haircut this time. I just told her to do whatever she wanted to do with it. I was good with that. Yeah, I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, starving. It is three o'clock in the afternoon, and haven't had any lunch. And <sighs> hubby's home starving, so I'm gonna go and pick up some uh, fish and chips. And so it's kind of like lunch dinner, so let's just call it dinner. Okay, we're gonna have some dinner at three o'clock because we're starving, and I don't feel like going home and cooking. So. Okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Heading to the fish and chip store, restaurant. It is delicious. It is quite famous in our hometown. And um, I don't eat very much deep fried food, so um, I'll get a small portion, like a kid's portion. <sighs> yeah, I feel good. <clears throat> I managed to get through my haircut without coughing, which was nice, because people kind of look at me weird when they hear me coughing. It's like, ooh, she's got cooties. <sighs> yeah, I like it. I like my hair. Yeah, she cut it blunt this time, so just for something. To... Well, that was really, yeah. Almost had an accident. That guy just cut right in front of us, and we had a green light. And that poor person in front of us almost got T-boned. You never know. You just never know the moment it could happen to you. So be careful out there, guys, when you're driving, please. Okay. Go get my fish and chips. Be right Go back. Put hair in my face. Hmm. <laughs> picked up some things for little surprises in uh, the British store for Andrea and Lenly. I'm going to be mailing them off very soon. 
just one more thing to get and I have to go to a different store for that so and that's for Lenly that's a surprise Lenly so probably might try and get that mail tomorrow if I can get out to pick up the other item I want to put in that box it's just a couple of little things just a couple of little things so but I want them to be a surprise for Lenly so I don't want I don't want to say what it is because I hope they still have some left. I'm gonna go check it out and see if I can see if I can get it. it. Might even pop out later on. I love seeing his face <laughs> when he opens uh, when he opens up something he loves. It gives me so much joy. To see his face, I really, oh, you can't, you have no idea. You have no idea. And I have another box that, um, well, I mailed a little thing off today for Brenda, just a little thing. And it's something that she'd been looking for and I found it. So I mailed that off to you, Brenda. And you should get that probably sometime next week. And then I have another little gift that I'm gathering a couple of little extra things. Excuse me, I'm eating, I'm sucking a candy I got in the fish and chip store. It's an aniseed. I love aniseed. It's like a licorice taste. Um, and yes, so I have another parcel to send out and it's, it's little bits and pieces of different things and uh, yeah. I have on a different scarf today, girls, and I was watching a tutorial on how to tie scarves, and this is a new knot, and it's really good because you can feed it through, and um, this is a scarf from my daughter-in-law, my beautiful daughter-in-law got me this scarf, and it has um, writing all over it, all over the world, it's got Paris, Ireland, um, oh my goodness, what else does it have on it? It's such a pretty scarf, all different, different countries all over the world, and it's written all over the scarf. It's beautiful. So I had to practice different, different knots and different ways of tying it. And a little bit of pink and a little bit of gray. And I was in the post office posting, uh, mailing off your parcel, Brenda, and the girl says, oh my gosh, she says, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm dreading this storm coming. And I said, what storm? She said, oh, we're supposed to get a snowstorm. And I'm going, are you kidding me? A snowstorm. I am not kidding you we are getting a snowstorm so if we're getting that snowstorm I'm not sure where it's coming from if it's coming from the north or if it's coming up from New York so I hope it's not coming up from New York so I hope you're not getting it I hope it's a north north of Canada kind of storm it's just gonna sweep in and, and kind of you know um, leave us all with a little bit of snow and then go away again and today's the last day of March, so it's supposed to come through the night. So I'm not looking forward to that. Anywho, I'm almost home, girls. And um, I'm going to sign out and try and uh, edit this video after I have my fish and chips. And then uh, get it up tonight sometime. It's not a very exciting vlog today, but... You know, it's tradition that I always do a little bit of a vlog when I get my hair done. So, you can't drop to this. Tradition, ladies. Tradition. So, I'm going to go and um, don't let anyone, I mean anyone or anything, dull your sparkle.